Knights Tech UK here again with a slightly different video than I do normally. Uh, this is more of an informative video to let you guys know that there's new drivers out for NVIDIA's uh, GeForce GTX 870M and the GeForce uh, GTX 880M uh, graphics cards. Uh, they're in beta, they are available on the website, on uh, NVIDIA's website, so you don't have to any longer rely on your uh, laptop manufacturer to actually uh, give you drivers. These new drivers are amazing. They really, really are. I've seen massive, massive uh, jumps in uh, performance in benchmarks and in games. Now, the new drivers uh, are in beta. They're the uh, 337.50 drivers. Uh, you can get them directly off NVIDIA's uh, website. It will enable you to use Shadow Play on the new GeForce Experience 2.0. Uh, you, if you've just upgraded to the uh, GeForce Experience 2.0 and using the old drivers, you can't actually uh, use Shadow Play, but you can if you upgrade to the uh, beta drivers. Uh, as you can see, I'm playing Skyrim with everything up full, and I'm using a high-res uh, texture pack. Uh, as you can see, it the frame rate's lovely, very smooth. Uh, the drivers, are, I can't express how good they are now. Uh, I run a few benchmarks, and I'm seeing you know 15, 20, 25 percent uh, like increases in in scores, and even in like Titanfall, the frame rate is even more solid, even more fluid uh, than it was before. Uh, I've only had the drivers for a few hours, uh, but everything I've seen with uh, the drivers have been very impressive. Uh, I highly recommend you upgrade to the uh, 337.50 beta drivers from the NVIDIA website. Uh, hopefully this will help you get better performance out of your uh, graphics card. I don't think that is going to be uh, just for the GT70. I reckon any uh, GTX 870M graphics card, if you've got that in your laptop, stick it in, stick that, uh, them drivers in and see if you get a uh, performance boost. If you don't, you can always go back to the old drivers, but I very much doubt you'll need to. Uh, anyway, if you're having any troubles, don't forget, put a comment below, and I'm sure someone will be able to help you out. If I can't, I'm sure we'll be able to find someone who can, but I can't I can't foresee any problems with the, uh, the new drivers. I've, as I said, I've been playing lots of different games over the, uh, the past couple of hours, and I've seen like a good, good, good increase in performance, and it's not just even better frame rates. The game seems to be even smoother, and the f uh, loading times. I don't know why, but loading times in Titanfall have halved. They have literally halved. Now I'm like, oh, has the game's loaded. So for some reason, the graphics card drivers before the I think they were the uh, 335.2 two three drivers i think they must have been bottlenecking the uh, loading times of titanfall anyway if you do install them let people know leave comments below see uh, so give us your opinions on the actual uh, the actual drivers themselves uh, but until next time always remember subscribe stay safe